Blizzard announces Dragonflight beta key giveaways have started. If you guys watched any Twitch streams yesterday besides mine, which you might, which you may have done, you know, I do go offline eventually. Yeah, you can watch other people if you want to. I don't hate it. Uh, beta keys are starting to be given away. Yep, beta keys are starting to be given away. Today is the 15th. A lot of Twitch streamers were talking about it yesterday, saying beta keys are going to start tomorrow. Well, here it is. Dragonfly beta keys in full swing. With more op, uh, with more opportunities and test realms uh, joining with a more opt. Yes, okay, fine. I'm, I'm struggling here. To test weekly, okay. To help those who have yet to uh, have the fortune of smile upon them with beta access, we are happy to share we're expanding the number of ways you too can join beta testers. Yeah, so they gave a bunch of keys to a bunch of streamers. I'm not one of them. Because Blizzard won't even let me loot a mount on stream. You think they're going to give me a beta key? I can't even fucking get invincible. You think they're going to give me a beta key? They're not. Okay? Oh, nice. We got a tank. They're not. We're just not going to do it. So, uh, for Thursday, you know, 9.50... Thursday to Saturday? Today to Saturday? We see Towley. So, we'll raid Towley today because he's going to have a beta key giveaway. Uh, we'll make sure that, you know, my viewers get a chance to get a beta key because they sure as shit ain't going to get a chance to get a beta key on my stream. Because fuck it. Blizzard hates me. Yeah, so Tally's going to get it. And then uh, Sunday, um, you know, we see who's getting some. Uh, we've, we've raided Nagaru before, so Nag Nagura. So you guys can get in there, maybe. And then Wednesday, next week, hey, there he is. Look at that. Wednesday to Friday, Mr. GM. We'll be raiding Mr. GM. Let him get his uh, get his keys to you guys as well. So if you haven't gotten a beta key yet, unlike Reyna, who says she has one. Father Souls, what's up? Um, you guys can get into these streams and get beta keys. Again, it starts today. We'll be raiding Tauli probably after stream, so you guys get a chance to get in there. More. More. Black Dragon Faction Reputation Rewards in Dragonflight. So I got a little bit excited to see these. You know, because uh, reputation rewards, I, hey, why why not? Let's see if there's some cool stuff to grind out. Indeed, there is. Oh, Rain, let me make sure I'm repaired. I think I am. I mean, it's it's Castle Nathria, so there's a repair at the entrance. I shouldn't care. <clears throat> uh, some, some, some cool rewards. Armoire of the Endless Cloaks. Covered in previous posts, the Armoire of Endless Cloaks drops a closet that players can access to gain random cloak effects. The closet lasts 5 minutes, and the item itself has a 15-minute cooldown. The cloak buffs last for 30 minutes. It's funny because this is the Black Dragon Flight, and, uh, and we all know that Rathian is the cloak master, right? He gave us legendary cloaks back in, in BFA, and uh, now there's a cloak thing that comes with his, you know, maybe his Dragon Flight uh, thing. So look at that. I mean, you get different cloak effects. That's pretty cool. Oh, here's a floating eye. Yeah, that's cool. I think that's a cool little toy. Why not have it in there? Some cloak appearances include well-remembered cloaks effects, such as legendary Mists of Pandaria cloaks and the Azuron, uh, Azuron Kamas cloak of the Battle for Azeroth. Yes, very cool. Another thing, another award here. This is the Dragonkin Battle Pet. Currently in beta, uh, this item is glitched and teaches the Crimson Proto Whelp instead. It is to be expected that it'll be, yes, a Black Dragon Whelp. Yeah, look at how cute these little whelps are. Yeah, cute stuff. Anyone who's into Battle Pets and all that, I know Entgrove is a huge Battle Pets fan. There you go. Obsidian Egg Clutch. Now, this one's kind of cool. Gives you some Game of Thrones vibes. This toy drops three Black Dragon Eggs to the floor which eventually hatch into three mischievous dragons. Yeah, you watch Dragon Thrones, you know. Three dragon eggs, three dragons. Rowdy, Blitz, and Onion. The three dragons roam around the area and can be petted, which makes them grow. And if, the, if you pet them enough, they will take a deep breath. Oh, look at that, they blow some fire. That's a cool, I think that's a cool little, uh, little toy there. Three little dragon whelps flying around you that can grow if you slash pet them. I'm in beta as well, and it's fun. Oh, okay, so everyone's in beta. Everyone's in beta except me. That's how it is, I see. Raid is set to mythic. Yeah, we got to change that. There we go. Fixed. 
All right, uh, now uh, this is the gear set here. This actually looks kind of nice. The ensemble. This is the Seblians Battle Gear Cloth Armor. Uh, we see this is a cloth ensemble that grants armor appearing similar to Sabellians himself uses uh, in Dragonflight. The armor set comes with a robe or and a tunic variety. This armor set's really nice. I mean, the nicest thing about this set is the shoulders. I can imagine a lot of people using these uh, these lava cracked shoulders and some transmogs, for sure. This is a nice set. Uh, you know, why not have some more transmog in the game? One thing I'm kind of li I'm a little bit turned off by some of the Dragonflight armor is how painted on a lot of it looks. I don't want painted. I want 3D sets. I want 3D sets. Whoa, Sugar Dust is on early today. Very nice. Very nice. Yeah, so some cool rewards. The Obsidian uh, Weapons Ensemble. Here's another one that, uh, you know, you could check out. We've seen, I think we've seen a, a version of this before in green, maybe. And then here's something else. For dragon riding customization, the Black Dragon sells gold and black armors. This is really cool. As well as black scale colors for dragon riding mounts. So you can get golden armor. Man, I, t I can't wait to customize my dragons, man. I can't wait. I cannot wait. So get your gold armor sets. And then there's also the black scales customization that you can unlock through reputation grinds. I mean, I'm convinced to do reputation grinds just for stuff like this. I'll be down to do it for sure. Tunnel man. Tunnel man. So we continue on. Blizzard notes on endgame testing realms. Rated Soto Shuffle and Mystic Plus. Yes, so raid testing is starting soon. So Blizzard's opening up some beta servers where people will be able to test um, the Solo Shuffles, Mythic Plus, and raid soon. And with that came some new uh, raid maps. So Dragonflight's first raid, Vault of the Incarnates. We got to see some maps. We got to see some maps of the raid that we'll be doing here. This is some cool stuff. I don't know if this is the entrance here because there's a little swirl, but this looks like a very cool entrance. There's not much we can gather from these. I mean, obviously, okay, there's some lava in here. This looks like a very, you know, like, ice-frozen room, maybe. Uh, but, I mean, they're just general maps of, of, the, of the lay of the land in the, uh, in the raid. This is probably some kind of boss fight room, I'm assuming, in here. Oh, look at that. We got the different dragon flights. This looks like it's going to be a nice-looking room. Just different maps of the room. Oh, look at that. Multiple platforms. And uh, all in all, you know, we haven't gotten a look inside of the raid yet, but I'm really excited to see it. I think it's going to be, you know, Blizzard does raiding right. That's for sure. Blizzard does raiding right. I mean, raiding in, in World of Warcraft has always been top tier. No matter how good or bad the expansion is, it's always been top tier. So, of course, I'm excited for Vault of the Incarnates. I want to get in there. I want to start playing it.